of our project is called TerraTooth. Uh, so basically we invented a semiconductor silicon uh, integrated circuit that can operate at terahertz. Uh, basically it's hundreds of times higher than the normal uh, circuits and what it does is actually it can enable the very precise early detection of the cavity inside the tooth. Another part of this project is to make the chip very low cost so that everybody can uh, afford it and also the size of the device we are inventing is very small so we can actually place the device inside our tooth uh, to detect the cavity. So uh, in the future we hope to uh, sell millions of such devices uh, to the market. Cloud Network is an idea to basically create a network of digital billboards and unlike the conventional model where you have to contact the advertising agency to get an advertisement onto the billboard, we built the website and with a few clicks any company can uh, deploy an ad onto one of our billboards. Um, along with that, we're also working on an analytics engine which allows our billboards to collect real-time information about who's looking at the ads. And uh, not so far down the road, we want to be able to provide information such as um, age, gender, um, and ethnicity. Uh, so the real um, key feature of Cloud Network is it's very, very flexible. Uh, our website allows businesses to buy time slots from 15 seconds to hours. Basically, the idea of Skinny is um, we want to create a home medical device that, you know, the same way you wash your weight in the morning, you can basically scan yourself and find more about your body and basic vital signs and biometrics such as um, like blood pressure, blood glucose, cholesterol, heart rate, um, blood oximetry, stuff like that. And basically, from that, we want to sort of get a consistent data of a person's health. And basically, through that, we use machine learning and we want to basically um, uh, diagnose illnesses or possible you know, ailments that they're getting before they actually start to manifest. Yeah, so what we wanted to do is we wanted to create some sort of system where uh, we didn't want to just be able, we didn't want to just scan a patient and tell them, oh, this is your heart rate, this is your blood pressure, give them nonsensical data that won't really give them much depending on the person. We wanted to have the machine also be able to look at trends of people's health, be able to tell them, oh, you're healthy because of this, or, oh, you're at risk of this illness because of these uh, certain biometrics that are changing over time. And so we wanted to build kind of a system where people could be more proactive with their health so that they could take their health into their own hands.